Hey guys, so I'm going to be doing the weekly reading for the sign of Aries. We're going to be taking a look to see what messages spirit has for you. If this video resonates with you, I'd really appreciate it if you like, comment, share, and subscribe. That helps me out a lot. And I do offer private readings. So um, if you want more insight on something that's going on in your personal situation, um, there's information in the description box on how to book a personal reading with me. All right. So... This is a general collective reading. This will not resonate with everyone. Take what resonates and leave the rest, please. This could resonate for Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Aries. Ooh, I just saw the Eight of Cups. Somebody's walking away from something. something somebody's walking away from something that's not emotionally fulfilling for them. All right, guys. Let's see. What is that on my cards? All right. What's going on with my Aries? Ooh, yeah. Somebody's disappointed here. Somebody's feeling some regret. Maybe because you walked away from them. Sadness, pessimism, disappointment. Yeah, I feel like you withdrew from somebody. You pull back your energy. Somebody's feeling regret now. Mm. Magician. One more. Somebody's manifesting a new beginning, though. Somebody's manifesting a lot of growth, abundance. The lovers. Somebody could um, be manifesting a connection here. Let's see. What is this? Yeah, somebody's manifesting here. I feel like something is going to manifest for you guys once you guys put your stick up for yourself set some boundaries with somebody which i feel like you guys are you guys are pulling back your energy from somebody here once you guys go through a lot of healing you're going to be manifesting some type of union here you guys are stepping into your divine energy like divine masculine divine feminine all right you guys are going to be going in a new direction Yep, there's that two of wands again. You guys are going to be going in a new direction, planning for the future here. Move this crystal. Judgment. Mm, you guys are having some type of wake-up call. Or like you guys are listening to your intuition and it's like... Yeah, I'm telling you. Your intuition is telling you that... Giving you a wake-up call that you need to end things with this person. Reject them. Do not accept an offer from them. Pull your energy back. Take a pause. Reflect on the past. Move away, reflect on the past, learn the lessons, move on. And that's going to lead you to a lot of success and victory. There may be a water sign around you guys. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. That's um, wanting to, um, trying to work up the courage to offer you something here. This could be that person. This could be that person that's feeling disappointed. Um, that's maybe why they're having to work up courage to come towards you. They're wanting to offer you something stable now that you've pulled your energy back, but you guys are moving on. You guys are moving on to better things here. You're closing out this cycle. Yeah, because this person broke your heart, all right? You wanted, you could, you saw happiness and fulfillment with this person. This person may have even had a third party for some of you guys. This person could have had another person. Possibly an earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This could have been somebody that they had children with. They may have been trying to be with this other person for money. The stability that that person provided. But you're, I feel like you're walking away. There's that eight of cups that I saw in the very beginning. You guys are walking away from this situation. You guys are. This is the eight to the nine. You guys are walking into what makes you happy, what fulfills you. Wish fulfillment. Yeah, focusing on yourselves, independence. having new beginnings here you guys are gaining some type of wisdom or some type of information here that's going to make you put your guards up to this person pull back i'm telling you and make it's going to make you go and have a new beginning elsewhere you guys are going to be holding back from this person 
Yeah, this person's like going to be gaining clarity that they do want to offer you something. That they're going to be taking action to try to make amends for you, with you, ask for your forgiveness. But I'm telling you, this is a burden to you. You're, this cycle is closing out. This person's going to be feeling very defeated, but oh well. Yeah, it's like they're going to be trying to rush in, trying to have a union with you after you've not spoken to them. After you've gone, you maybe ghost them, and now they're all trapped in their head. They're getting some type of karma. This is the second reading today that I've done that somebody is getting their karma. Mm. Yeah, I feel like you, you're blocking this person. The divine is guiding you to block this person. You guys may have somebody else coming in. I see earth here. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, or somebody this is just very mature, stable, successful, career oriented. Maybe possibly a business owner for some of you guys, a father. I see stability with this person, possibly. You guys manifesting um, some type of abundant new beginning with this person. Healing, getting your wish fulfillment. You guys may be a little conflicted on whether or not you want to come together with this person. Probably because you guys are just fed up with the, you know, dealing with situations like that you did with this past person. You know, you guys are tired. You guys are a little bit guarded. But I feel like this person is going to want to invest in you. They're going to want to invest in you. I see new beginning in love. I see progress here. Yeah, progress towards long-term stability and happiness. Um... This person, there's going to be reciprocity in this situation. There may have been not been, there obviously wasn't equal give and take with this other situation, but it will be with this person. I'm telling you guys, though, that this person, though, is going to be trying to pursue you guys to communicate with you. They're still a player. They, they're still unstable. But they're going to get this. They're going to be shocked because I feel like maybe you guys have never had your guards up with them as much as you do now. And it's going to be a tower moment for them because I feel like you're going to block this person. You're going to abandon this person. <laughs> they're not going to be able to sleep at night. They're going to be going through a lot of anxiety and fear, sad, sadness, maybe even crying. Yeah. This person doesn't know that you're manifesting your divine masculine. You're not focused on this crap anymore with them. Yeah, you're focused on your happiness. Putting effort into your career, possibly, for some of you guys. Yeah. You guys are going to be manifesting somebody that's going to put work into you. That's going to bring you forth some stability. You guys are going through a transformation here. This situation ending with this person was there is justice. That's them getting, you getting your good karma. Like, it's actually like a blessing in disguise for you. Maybe at first it didn't seem like it was going to be, but. Yeah. This person was just in a very like dishonest, deceptive energy. This person didn't know how they felt. I feel like they had maybe a third party. They were juggling. They couldn't make up their mind. They were being dishonest with you. They had options. They were confused. They were living in illusions. They were cheating. They were lying. Deception. I'm telling you guys. Wow, I just went through the whole deck with you guys. So guys, I'm not going to extend this reading because I feel like I just literally just went through the whole deck. Um, and I feel like this is like a very, you know, the story really played out very well here. You know, you guys can see what happens here. Um, but yeah, I really feel like there's a lot of people getting their karma. I'm telling you guys. But yeah, I feel like you guys are moving on to bigger, better things. All right. So I hope that this reading helped you. Um, thank you so much for watching and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.